Hi there, you join me on the 0706 Elizabeth Line service to London Paddington because today on the 6th of November 2022, phase 2 of the Elizabeth Line will be in operation which means you can catch a train from here, where I'm at at Maidenhead all the way through to Abbey Wood but today's video will focus on the central core sections itself so I'm catching a train from here to London Paddington get there for 7.42 and I'll be catching the 0802 off London Paddington which goes through the central core section to Acton Maylai. This will be the first train to run through that stretch in passenger service. They get off at Acton Maylai and then head over on another train for Acton Maylai to head into the central core section again. Also be the first train from the West End into the central core section. This is the train to Paddington. Get interrupted by announcements and then head over to Bond Street and then to the Great Eastern Maylai. So we're going to leave Maidenhead now and head into central London. We have made it to the lower level at Paddington Railway Station and honestly I do feel very excited about it. The 802 is the first train off this low level at Paddington to head to the West End. So it should be right now so I can catch it to Acton Main Line. This is the train to Heathrow, Terminal 5. So we're now just left Paddington and we're literally coming out of the tunnels right now to head onto the Great Western May Line. It definitely feels historic that, but not as enthusiastic like it was on the 24th of May, to be honest. Anyway, let's get to Acton May Line so we can change trains and head back into the central core section. That's my train now leaving the Acton May Line. I'm going to head over to the old platform now and head back on a train towards Abbey Wood. But I shall be getting off of Bond Street because I haven't visited Bond Street yet. Unfortunately, when Bond Street was opened, there was engineer works on the Trent Valley Line, so I couldn't come down. So I want to see Bond Street as we carry our journey towards the east to go to the Great Eastern May Line. What a memorable first day, it's actually downpouring here at Acton May Line. But here's our next train just arriving out to head back into the central call section. This has come from Heathrow Airport and it's stopping literally down there so I've got to run back onto the train from here to catch this train back. So let's go, get out of the rain. That rain was sky falling down, was it, at Acton May Line? Anyway, for your eyes only, this is Bond Street Railway Station. I've finally been to Bond Street now. It opened on the 24th of October 2022, and there's been wonderful videos from this station, but I'm just going to have a quick look around here and then head to the west end, well, eastern end, sorry, not the western end, because I came from the western end. So we're going on to Great Eastern May Line, I have to have a quick look around at Bond Street. Well, this lovely view outside Bond Street here, this is definitely a view, a view to a kill. Yes, there could be a lot of Bond punts. Do you expect me to go to Abbey Wood? No, Mr. Simon Trades, I expect you to go to Shenfield. Just stop to know I'm not going in the rain again. Actually, I might have to. 
Bearway also at Bond Street could change here for the Central Line and the Jubilee Line. But anyway, we're going to leave Bond Street now and head to the Great Eastern May Line. After Whitechapel, the line actually branches off to Abbey Wood and Shenfield, with the next station after Whitechapel is Stratford. Not going to Stratford, I'll go around the Great Eastern May Line, but we are going through the other tunnels and we'll do a bit of track onto the Great Eastern May Line. So our train's arriving now to take us somewhere on the Great Eastern May Line. tunnels and now we're on the Great Eastern May Line. So I'm going to find a Great Eastern May Line railway station on the Lisbeth Line to get off. <laughs> So I decided to get off at Maryland Railway Station. No, there's no cookies here. So if you want a cookie, sorry to disappoint you, but there's no cookies here. But anyway, let's talk about the Elizabeth Line because as I mentioned back in May, when I visited all the stations apart from Bond Street at the time, that the Elizabeth Line was a game changer. And that one step closer today when three lines become two, it's another game changer today because people from Reading slash Heathrow Airport can go to Abbey Wood Direct. People from Paddington could go to Shenfield Direct. I thought I'd never say that till today. You could get a train from Paddington all the way through to Shenfield, believe it or not. And the Elizabeth Line, it's, it's just an honest game changer. And one step closer when three lines become two lines, does give that game changing better. Next May in 2023 is when the Elizabeth Line would be fully operational. And it should be a lovely day indeed unlike today which is absolutely chucking down with rain so anyway, i'm going to finish up now so if you did like this video feel free to like subscribe comment down below i've been simon trains thank you for watching this video stay safe and i'm going to find somewhere to edit this video now thank you very much for watching